yeah, I didn't know. Like, I was being recruited from every level. So I really didn't know which route to take, what was going on. And I just kind of landed at University of Mobile just because I didn't take the recruiting process seriously. So when I, what I, what I mean when I say that, um, like I would have coaches reach out to me um, and I wouldn't respond or I wasn't very communicative and uh, I just didn't know any better, right? And I didn't have people um, around me that could lead me in the right direction. And I'm 16 years old trying to navigate this space and I'm doing it all wrong, right? Um, people telling me not to go JUCO, um, not to go Division Three. Like it was just a mix of people in my ear, but I wasn't being led in the right direction at all. So kind of my uh, decision-making process was based upon time, how much time I had left to commit. Um, and I kind of rushed that process. So I ended up at University of Mobile for my first two years um, and ended up transferring my sophomore year to Huntington. And I, I ended up at Huntington, really didn't know much about the school or the program, but um, the coach and I really connected. And at the time I needed that coming out of the situation that I was in at Mobile. Um, and it ended up being fine for my last two years of playing. So I definitely didn't have a traditional uh, recruiting experience. Um, and that's partly me to blame just because you do have to take some accountability or ownership in your own process and not let people do it for you. Um, but you don't know what you don't know, right?